Gulf Coast Weather Authority. This is Fox 26 Morning News. The Joe Negro Foundation is an organization aimed at saving lives, preventing people from dying too young. It's, of course, named after former Houston Astros pitcher Joe Negro, who himself died at a young age from a brain aneurysm. Natalie Negro is Joe Negro's daughter and established the foundation. Enos Cabell is a special assistant for the Astros and played for the Astros during part of his 15 major league career. And also Dr. Raymond Weir practices neurointerventional radiology at Kingwood Medical Center. Welcome to each and every one of you for being with us this morning. Thank Natalie, such a big loss for you and your family. We have to tell you how sorry we are about that. But you, you are trying to make sense of this by getting out and telling people that you can get screened for this. There are treatments for brain aneurysms. Absolutely. Absolutely. Matter of fact, it's one in 15 people will have an aneurysm. And I didn't even know what one was when my father passed away. And it was then that I said, I've got to do something. I've got to um, help others, let them know that they are treatable. They just need to know if they have one. And so the foundation is based solely on raising money for education, for research, for um, awareness, and just letting people in the public know that they can do something about it. And this can happen to anybody. Your dad was in great health. He had run five miles that morning that mm -hmm. it happened. Yeah. I mean, he was as healthy looking and, and acting as you can get. Mm -hmm. So it's got to just be such an awareness campaign for you to tell people it can happen it is. to you. It is, absolutely. What, let's talk about some of the symptoms and the warning signs of this. Um, what, what do you tell people, Dr. Weir, about, about brain aneurysms? Uh, it's, a, um, it's a disease that's seen in, in anywhere from 3 to 5% of the population. Uh, unfortunately, uh, aneurysms, uh, by and large, are relatively asymptomatic. Mm -hmm. On occasion, uh, person may have an atypical headache or a weakness. We have some of the um, symptoms up on our screen yeah. because we want people just to it's, take time, look, t walk over to your television screen and take a look at some of these. Yeah, the headache you have to realize is usually a different headache than you're normally accustomed to. That's what most patients would tell you. It's usually the worst headache they've had or it's a different headache. They will they will tell you that's right. Uh, on occasion, you'll, you'll get the stiffness in the neck. That's usually from a leaking of the aneurysm. Mm -hmm. And if you ever get that, then you're still okay. It's very important that you get into the hospital right away. Way. So important uh, to find out quickly. Enos, you certainly have a personal story. You lost your wife yes. to this problem as uh, well. Yes, I'm almost the same. Me and myself and Joe played together for numerous years. Mm -hmm. And it's, as both of us know, you're healthy. You, know, you feel great. Uh, my wife was never sick at all. And all of a sudden, she passed out. And 10 days later, she was gone. So it's, it's very dear to both of us. And when Natalie started this foundation, I was one of the first people to go on board because of what it does to you. And nobody knows about it, as Doc said, and all of a sudden it hits you. And then you're lucky if you last. Mm -hmm. And there's, there has been survivors. We've got one with us today. And it's very, very tragic to the family. Oh, it is such a difficult situation. And again, thank you for sharing your story because we know th that you have been through a lot. And do you suggest, just like these two, that you get screened? You guys have great t-shirts that say stuff like, want to get lucky, get scanned. I mean, you have great campaign out there trying to raise awareness about this. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you have a big event coming up this weekend, it knuckleball, is which your night. dad was quite known for those yes. most unbelievable knuckleballs that he threw. Yes. Tell yes. us about the event. It is. It's tomorrow night. It's at Minute Maid Park. And, you know, it's taking all the things that my dad loved. He loved, uh, he loved a good time. He loved country music. We have um, Chuck Wicks is performing. And then all, a lot of my dad's teammates and former players are coming to attend. And it's a black tie gala. And we're just going to have a good time and raise awareness. No, it's pitch, all about bringing awareness. A pitch for, a pitch life. for life. I love the name of it. I mean, it, it just you. wraps up your dad in such a beautiful way. And again, this happens at Minute Maid Park. Starts at 6:30. How do we get those tickets? Online at uh, JoeNecroFoundation.org. All right, and it's actually mm -hmm. I appreciate you all being here so much. Thank, Thank you, you very so much, Jose.